Welcome to the Pines at Berlin Station. This is a brand new home community that's built right off of the Alum Creek Reservoir in southern Delaware County. I happen to be building my own personal home here right now and we'll go visit that a little bit later on. For right now, we're on the walking path here and let's take a walk and talk about the community. So we're here on the walking path. We're getting ready to come up on a clearing here, but I wanted to take some time and introduce my assistant. Her name is Sarah. She's going to be handling the filming of this, but for now, I just thought I'd give this a test. So here at the Pines, there's going to be 177 total homes. Now just to give you some proximity of where this is, literally when I threw a drone up earlier, we were able to see Alum Creek Reservoir from the drone at 200 feet, which for what it's worth, that's right over the trees. Additionally, there's a park in the center of the community, absolutely gorgeous. The new section that's being uh, worked on right now, you probably hear some of that in the background, that new section connects up to Berlin High School, brand new high school here in the Olentangy School District. So here at the Pines, this community was literally carved in the middle of all these big beautiful trees. This used to be a tree farm. So even across the way, there is still a, a small tree farm that does Christmas trees and such. But this community really took advantage of the natural woods, the natural ponds. This is one of the reasons that my wife and I decided to build here. And actually, as you look across this pond, that is where I'm building my house. So the house that you see right over my shoulder here. That happens to be the house that I'm building for, for my wife and I. Now, you'll notice a couple of things about it. Number one, you'll notice that it has a walkout lot, which means that from the basement, I can walk directly out onto the backyard. Additionally, up the top, we're gonna to put this very large deck all the way across the, the back of it. So, my, my wife wanted to be on water and I wanted to be backing against woods. So try to imagine when we found this lot and we fell in love. So she gets her water and then I get my woods. So you really can't get much better than that. These are the kind of lots that you can find in this community. We found our shade tree here to talk about the things that are close by because the list is long. So on my shoulder is Alum Creek State Park. I mean, literally through the woods, across Lackey Old State, you would be at Alum Creek. By the way, if you're ever up at Alum Creek and you're looking for great pizza, Cheshire Market, awesome. We're nestled about halfway between Delaware and Sunbury. Now, it's really quiet here, but I can be on Interstate 71 in about five minutes. We're also close to the Outland Malls at 3637, plus the restaurants that are up there, the Bob Evans, the Cracker Barrel, there's McDonald's, Wendy's, there's a new Chipotle going in, lots of choices up there. We're also close to all of the great restaurants that are over in Delaware, places like the Thurman Cafe, the Hamburger Inn, uh, there's 1808, which is a high-end steakhouse. It's just awesome. Now, just down the road the other way is Polaris Mall and all of the amenities that are around Polaris. So let's say that you have someone who's coming to visit. We have some smaller hotels that are up here really close. And then, of course, down at Polaris, you have the big Hilton and, and the, the, the bigger hotels down there. All the shopping that is at Polaris Mall then the outlet malls added in, you're kind of in the perfect place. If you have children, Berlin High School, which is a brand new high school in the Olentangy School District, is just right up around, uh, around the corner. And in fact, this community, once the next phase goes in, you'll be able to actually walk within the community to get over to the high school. Just down from Berlin High School is the elementary school and then also close by is the middle school. So really, 
this is kind of the best of all worlds because you have the rural feel, but yet all of the niceties of having all those amenities close by. So here at the Pines at Berlin, there are two builders. One is MI Homes over, over my one shoulder, and then the other is Rockford Homes over my other shoulder. Both of these models are here. They're open pretty decent hours. Now let's talk about MI Homes for a minute. I currently live in an MI home, and I can certainly say we've enjoyed our time in it. MI does give you some customization options. You can add on certain things. You can change certain things to some degree. Now, currently I'm building with Rockford Homes. That's their model right over here. Now, my home that I'm building and the reason I chose to go that route is because I literally changed everything. And surprisingly, it wasn't that expensive to make all those changes. So what, whether, I mean, MI certainly has some beautiful floor plans and then they have some nice amenities that you can add on and you can do some customization in this community. But if you're really looking to take it over the top to that next level and really change around everything, then perhaps Rockford may be the better choice. Don't let yourself get confused though because MI builds a great product, great price. Rockford builds a custom product, but to be honest with you, I was able to keep the price point for my house still within the same range that I would build a similar home with MI. So really it comes down to what you need as to what fits you best. So as you can see, the kind of homes that are in this community range from a craftsman style to a farmhouse style to a more traditional style. Sods getting put in, new homes under construction. Just all kinds of activity going on up here. The community does allow fences, which we just passed one of those. So if you want to fence in the dogs or have a fence for the kids to play in, that's, that's perfectly fine. So one of the other things you'll notice about these homes is some of the homes have garages that face towards the front and some have side load garages. That's on purpose in this community. Now as we come around the corner here you'll see an example of a carriage garage which is just another different turn on the same type of, uh, of home. Okay so we settled in in front of the house that my wife and I are building you can see that it's a ranch property and then as we come around we've got a two-story then we've got another ranch that's under construction by the way if you're interested you can build right here on this lot right right in uh, up the road from where I'm building mine so here you can see that we've got a mixture of two-story we've got a lot of the craftsman style faces or the the uh, farmhouse faces and then here's another ranch so you can see there's a good mix of homes that are in the community so here we are at the park at the pines this sits in the center of the community it's a huge green space all the way around center uh, playground here nice place for everybody to gather plenty of room to play football, do whatever you want. Now, I could try to show it to you from here on the ground, but I'm gonna defer over and let the drone footage take over. We came out, we shot the drone footage, and we were able to show just how big this park is from the drone. Now, at the end of that drone footage, you're gonna see me take the drone up. Now, I'm only gonna be at 200 feet, and you'll be able to see Alum Creek Reservoir from that drone footage. So that shows you just how close it is. It's going back, it's going forth, and that should give you a pretty good estimate of what, of how close you are to Alum Creek State Park. So now we're out at the brand new section of the pines that is currently being cut in. The roads are going in. There's some beautiful lots that back up against the tree farm 
that are just going to be gorgeous. There's also a pond back there. And then if you go this way, that heads over towards Berlin High School. Now I can try to explain that from here on the ground, but again, running up with the drone footage, you'll be able to get a much, much better feel for it. If you look closely, you'll be able to see where the, the roads are being cut in. And then at the end, again, you'll be able to see Berlin High School, which is a brand new high school that is right at the end of the community. So I want to thank you for coming out to the Pines. This has been a great day out here. We really appreciate MI Homes, Rockford Homes, for putting together this beautiful community. I hope you enjoyed the, the walkthrough. Feel free to reach out, talk to me about it. The phone number is 614-554-7705. I'd be more than happy to talk to you about building in this beautiful community.